first at 10, a standoff in southwest Detroit. A man who was served an eviction notice from his home of 50 years is keeping police at bay inside his van. Let's get right to 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville live at the scene in southwest Detroit. Aaron. Heather and Glenda, we've been out here for a long time. Officers have been out here for nearly eight hours. This all started around two o'clock this afternoon when that 67 year old man was served those eviction papers down there. That's the center of the activity right now. Lafayette and Wheelock. That's where officers have been for several hours. I know some SWAT teams are positioned out here. That 67 year old man is still inside that van. He has been shot once in the rear. He was bleeding. It has stopped and officers are telling us right now he simply doesn't want to leave. He stated that uh, he's been in the location for 50 years. Uh, he does not want to lose his home and he's going to stay there until he feels like coming out. A tense scene for officers has now turned into a waiting game. A 67 year old man is hiding out in a van near Lafayette and Wheelock on the city's southwest side. This all started around 2 this afternoon when the man was served eviction papers. He thought he was getting robbed, so he called 911. When the cops showed up, he aimed his gun at them. You said he threatened him with a gun. Officers fired. Did he ever fire any shots at all? So he did not fire any weapons. Uh, he do have two long guns. His daughter also showed up at the scene waiting for any news, not understanding exactly what's going on. We're told one officer fired his gun, striking the man in the rear, and the bleeding has stopped for now. The entire area is locked down, and investigators tell us they will not go on the attack. There's no telling how long he'll stay inside that van. Now, right now, he's not a harm to the community. Right now, he's not a harm to himself. As he stated, uh, he does not want to die. He stated that he will come out. He's going to come out on his own time. So, of course, negotiators are out here. They have been in constant contact with this 67-year-old man for several hours. At one point, they were on the phone. He hung it up and said he needed some time to think. Since then, we have no idea if they have talked to him. Once again, this whole area is blocked off on lockdown. You'll want to avoid this area near Lafayette and Green, Lafayette and Wheelock on the city's southwest side. Let's send it back to you guys in the studio. All right. Thank you, Aaron.